So here we have my 06 Silverado. As you can tell, I have one paint much right here. The other one is black. I'm gonna be showing you how to switch them out. And right here is actually the new handles, color match to the truck. As you can tell, there's three bolts. There's one to the left, one the bottom, and one to the right with the little clip for the, the bolt there. Over here in the Silverado, we're gonna be taking off this door panel. Here we got the great door panel, standard with the bow system. We're gonna be taking out a bolt that's actually underneath here, and there's gonna be one underneath the clip underneath here. And this here is what the tools you're gonna need. You're gonna need a 10 mil, a flathead, 10 mil ratchet, or you can use a standard, it's up to you. And then here we have a seven mil with an extension onto my cordless, but you don't necessarily need the cordless. You can do this with the ratchet, but for me it's faster. And as, and as I stated earlier, we're gonna be popping this guy off as well. Pull this on off here. There's a seven mil up there, and I will be taking that off right now. As you can tell, I have a seven mil. And once that's back off, now for the 06s, I've noticed this with the older from like 99 to 02, there aren't these plugs here and here, but for the 06, there are. Um, I believe on this one here is a push clip on this side and a seven mil on that side. As you can tell, I'm pulling this out right now. It is actual push pin. I did get the clip off on the right one, which is this guy right here. Unfortunately, it is not. It's actually a Torx pen last at least before I do pop the door off. We're gonna be taking this little uh, lock button off, which just pops out. Easier if you have a, uh, a tool, but I just have a flathead. And then lastly, you should be able to just grab the truck, the, not the truck, but the door panel by its handle and pull up. But now that you can tell I have the door panel off, there's some LED shots right there for the door switches. And of course my turn signal mirrors, which is right there. And then the door panel light here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pull the door panel light off. And pull the door panel off and then go ahead and turn it and just let it sit like that. As long as you have the little door light out. Now here, we gotta pull this plastic panel light back. Down here, I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's a one bolt in there one hidden right here behind this mechanism now it's a pain in the butt to get out so you, what you want to do is you stick your hand back here behind the glass right like how i am right now you see my fingers that's where you want that little ratchet wrench to get the last bolt out and then there's this one right here which i'll go ahead and pull that out for you guys which you can use whatever you need to i'm just using a flathead right now it's fastest for me and then as you can tell the third one is in there so now that we've counted one, two, and then the third one back here, you wanna go ahead and pull all three of those 10 millimeter bolts out. Okay, now once you got all the bolts out, you go ahead and come over to this side, just grab the handle, pull it out, shake it, come down a little bit because there's that rod. Now here's the next thing, what you'll wanna do is see the rod right here comes through. This is plastic clip, what you wanna do, see if I can do it with my finger. Yep, is you'll pull this plastic clip up over and over, slide it out and the door handles out as you can tell there's one two and three of course the bottom one you don't necessarily have to take off if you don't want to i just choose two because it's easier sometimes they fall down sometimes they don't but me personally i do not have a magnetic uh socket to do it so yeah i'll show you guys in one second okay guys now that the new one is in there as you can tell there's a the front door there's the rear door and all you do is just repeat the process of putting the three tunnels back in together and everything i showed you to take it back off which i did forget to mention there is one seven mil sitting right there behind the door lock which i forgot about and that's it thanks for watching i hope you guys tune in to the next one